It sounds like you probably heard uh, AD's presser just there. Uh, he said that he felt like it was on him. He's got to play better for you guys to win. Just wondered your perspective on on that and what you guys can do uh, to you know to help him as well. Uh, you know, it's never just one guy. Um, but I love when AD uh, puts that pressure on himself. Uh, you know, we're a better team when, when he's aggressive. We're a better team uh, when he demands the ball. And um, you know, but we all got to do our jobs a lot better as well. Um, you know, tonight was a, a, a good, a great opportunity for us to uh, uh, to play better. And obviously, we didn't do that, but you know, we look forward to game two. spoken before about game one being a feel out game for you and uh, LeBron and you got to take it in you watch the film etc and I know you'll do that again but is there any initial impressions that you saw from this, from this scene that different from what you saw in the regular season um no we know how great of a team we're playing that's why they're number two team in the league um but we got to make shots um you know we did a hell of a job defensively obviously book you know played um exceptionally well you know uh, got into his groove made a lot of shots but you know we held this team to 99 points and we got to we got to put the ball in the hole as well. You know, we got to put some pressure on their defense, and uh, tonight we didn't do that. <coughs> Shay, LeBron, they, um, brought in with Chris Paul after the um, or near the, near the foul line. How was your shoulder, and was that a dangerous play? I'll be ready for game two. Hi. LeBron, how, how are you feeling about the on-court chemistry and connectivity of the team? Are, are these are these guys still learning each other? Are you, are you still learning guys to, that you haven't played with much? No, nah, we feel great. Um, we look forward to uh, watching the film tomorrow, breaking it down as a team and being better in game two. Mark? Well, LeBron, what, what was your reaction to the NBA that saying that you violated the health and safety protocols? What's, what's your perspective and explanation on all that? Uh, I'll be ready for game two. Bill? LeBron, specific to AD, um, you know, he said that you guys can't win a game, let alone a series, with him playing the way he played today. Do What 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 is needed of him in this matchup specifically and for you guys to win this series? Uh, it's always just AD being AD. Um, anytime he comes to the pressure and tell you guys we can't win without him or with him playing the way he played, uh, he always responds, so looking forward to that. And uh, when 80 is 80, then we're the Lakers. Dan? Hey, LeBron, I have two quick ones for you. Um, where do you think Aiden was able to really hurt you guys? Was that secondary kind of third level on, on defensive rotations? And then I guess just generally in your career, what, what has it been like for you between game one and game two that's allowed you to be so successful after these series opening losses? Uh, Aiden is a big body, and we knew that coming into the series that um, you know he does a hell of a job on the defense, on the offensive rebounding, and we got to control that. Um, you know, you put a lot of attention on Chris and Book, and, and it allows him to um, you know be down in the paint with a lot of smalls. You know, trying to box him out with our two guards and our points and things of that nature. And he's just big; he's able to jump over them and use his, uh, his athleticism and his length and his, uh, and his strength. So, you know, we got to do a much job, uh, a much better job of. Uh, uh, sandwich rebounding and uh, not allowing him to get these second chance points for their team because they just shoot it extremely well. Um, for two, it gives me uh, more time to just dissect the team, know what we did wrong in the previous game, especially games one. It's always been a fill out game for me, so um, looking forward to breaking down the, the film tonight and then as a team tomorrow and uh, even get some more um, on, on the day of the game, I believe Tuesday, and uh, get ready for that for that challenge again. Last two, Barry. Hey, LeBron, uh, you guys played till October 11th last year to win the championship. Seven months later, you're starting it all over again. How much of a challenge is this, considering the circumstances and the season, the conciseness of the season, your injury, AP's injury? How much more of a challenge is this this year? Uh, I mean, every year is a challenge. Um, it just feels like a big blur. Um, it, it feels like we went from one playoffs. Uh, to, to the next, to be um, completely honest. I feel like uh, we went from playing in the bubble, uh, you know, compete for a championship, to now being back in arenas and just traveling to compete for a championship. So 
Um, very taxing mentally and physically, but you know, only the strong survive. So, you know, we, we, we are in a position that we put ourselves in and, uh, you know, we are for the challenge. Last question, Yovan. Hey LeBron, um, on Friday we talked to you guys about the unique challenge of, of Phoenix and their mid-range attack in the pick and roll. Uh, I'm just curious what your first impressions were of how you guys defended Chris and, and Book in the pick and roll and kind of what you can improve on. Uh, well, I mean, at the point of attack, I think, uh, you know, Book was um, exceptional, exceptional off the pick and roll today, coming you know, full steam uh, against our bigs, against our smalls, living in the mid-range. Uh, also making great passes to his uh, to his bigs and things of that nature, um, but at the end of the day, we gave him 99 points. Um, so I thought we did a, a heck of a job. I know, like I said, Book got off some, but we did a heck of a job of trying to contain everybody else besides Aiden. Um, but as far as their mid range game, we did pretty damn good. Um, but uh, we got to be much better offensively, and that'll give us an even more better chance to win.